Hi everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel RD Technical Learning. So in this video, we are going to see a Java program to find the number of words in a string, the count of words in a string and the count of characters in each word. So before we start writing a Java program, first we will see the explanation part. So let's get started. So let's consider this is our input string. I love Java programming. So in this program, we have to find out the number of words in this string. So the number of words in this string is four. And next, we have to find the number of characters in each word. You can, you can see the output, what should be our output. So for i equal to 1, l equal to 4, java equal to 4, programming equal to 11. So this will be our output. So now let's see the explanation part. So first we need to initialize a string. I love Java program. After that very first we will split this string using split function of string class. And then we will get string array. After we get string array, here we will use hash map collection. So this is very important part in our program. So using hash map collection, we will get our output. So first we will create the object of hash map. You, uh, you all know the hash map is the, uh, the value of hash map. It will be in a key value pair. So we want key value pair for string, for word and the count of word means it will be in a integer. That's why we are using hash map here. You can understand, you will understand it by a program. So don't worry. After that, we will iterate each element of this string array using for loop. And after, and after in a for loop, we put each word in a hash map, each word and its length, each word and its length. Then we will get value in a key value pair. Okay. And then we will print hash map elements. Okay. Now let's write the program. So now in Eclipse, I am creating one Java class. Count words and character. Okay, and selecting main method from here. So as I told earlier, explanation part, first we will create one string. I love Java
programming so first we will split this string using split method and we will split it split it by spaces okay and then what we will get we will get string type array string array okay now so first we have to find out the number of words in this string so now we have the string array so by using length function of array we can find out the number of words in this given string so here i am using length function of array so now we can say the number of words in string is plus length so we got our first output and for second one first we have to create the object of hash map because we want our value in key value pair for that we need to mention data types for both the values okay here showing error because we need to import hash map collection from java.util package so in a java.util package there is a hash map class here also we have to mention these brackets we don't need to add this brackets here okay now now we will create one for loop int i equal to 0 i less than equal to s array of length minus 1 and i plus plus okay now we have to put
S array of I. So this is our word. Okay. Means element. Our string array element means our word. Each word in string array. And in value, we need to mention length means the count of characters present in that particular word. So here we use length. Here we have to mention this. Okay. Now we will get the uh, key value pair, pair in the form of string and integer. In a string, our word and the length of characters in each word in an integer. So now we have to print our hash map. So here we will add one sentence. Or, okay, number of character in each word. Okay. So now let's run our program. So see, this is our final output. Number of words in a string is four and number of character in each word for love is four java equal to four i equal to one and programming equal to 11. so thanks for watching this video